Hi, I'm Pauline, and I'm back with another awesome plyo move. Okay, this movement is called the bounding step hop. It's really simple, okay? You're basically going to get into a running motion. So the motion is simply dri is driving. And when you're doing the movement, I want you to practice getting up on your toes and back down. So this is actually a really great warm up before you actually move. <laughs> Step heel up on your toe. Arms are going to be your driving force. Abs tight, shoulders down, stepping. Okay? So let me do a couple for you so you know what it looks like. So you're going to step, hop, land on your toe. Step heel, hop, land on your toe. Step heel, hop, land on your toe. Okay? Let me get that to you again. So step, hop, up on your toe, heel toe. So you're basically doing a heel toe movement. And I'm actually really feeling this in my calves, but I'm also feeling it in my quads. My heart rate's up. So again, great cardio exercise. Now, with more space, you can do a lot with this. You can run further and get more power. So this move is a great vertical enhancer. You can actually get really great results um, if you're a basketball player um, going for that type of exercise. So again, I'm actually going to get higher. Okay, so notice what I did was I started from the ground into a step hop, but now I'm going higher, leaping off my toe. Try to land as soft as you can. Okay, step heel, hop, step heel, hop, step heel. So this time I'm going for height. Okay, so I can either go for height or I can go for distance from here. So height, as high as I can. Always breathing out on the up, okay? Use your arms for the driving force. Okay, up, elbow knee, elbow knee. If I'm on the track, I will probably use 40 yards or so and do this bounding exercise. You have to do it for a certain distance so that you can really get the benefit of the cardio benefit as well as the muscular power, explosive, vertical benefit. So this is really great as well to just do outside if you're doing a track workout or in the gym to have a really great distance anywhere from 20 to 40 yards and do it in sequence to where you're actually getting an active rest. So you're gonna do it 40 yards, kind of jog back for one minute or so, or do an active move, rest, and then you're bounding again. And that is how you do your bounding step hop.